Good Tuesday and happy Election Day, everyone. I'm meteorologist Dave Snyder with the National Weather Service with Alaska Statewide Weather. High pressure across the western Yukon is slowly giving way to some colder air across western and central Alaska. Light snows falling across the north slope along the Beaufort and Chukchi coast and along the western tip of the Seward Peninsula inside the Bering Strait. Several waves of low pressure will work across the Gulf of Alaska, the Alaska Peninsula, the eastern chain, and up into southeastern Alaska, and that's where it's really going to have more impact over the the next several days. A 969 millibar low is off the west coast of the outer parts of southeastern Alaska right now. At 969 millibars, that's enough to crank up the wind again across many in southeastern Alaska in the coming days. And as such, high wind watches and winter storm watches are posted. We'll get to more of that in just a minute. As we look at tonight, look for snow showers across the Chugach and parts of the Copper River Basin. Uh, periods of mixed rain and snow will be found around the higher terrain for Prince William Sound, but most areas along the Gulf Coast will be dealing with liquid precipitation through tonight. It looks like most of southeast will be dealing with an increase of winds, and uh, with that south and easterly flow, rain showers are most likely. A low pressure system out across the southern Gulf at 953 millibars will be working its way north and east, again increasing the weather opportunities for wind and winter weather across southeast as we head into Wednesday night. A quick glance up north for Wednesday shows snow showers are still possible along the Beaufort Sea coast. Watch for winds to come up across the central and eastern Bering Sea. Most of the Pribilovs up north toward St. Matthew and St. Lawrence Island will be dealing with snow showers there. The central Aleutian chain, a better chance for snow showers, but then gradually mixing to rain and snow as you move eastward in toward Nikolsky and Dutch Harbor on Alaska. The, uh, the Alaska Peninsula will be dealing with light rainfall, and gusty winds are expected to come up across parts of southeastern Alaska for Wednesday night and into Thursday. As such, a high wind watch is in effect for Wednesday evening through Thursday morning for parts of the eastern Gulf Coast, including Ketchikan, Sitka, Metlakatla, Craig, Klawak, Thorn Bay, Saxman, Heidelberg, just to name a few. Winds possible to blow up to 25 to 40 miles per hour, gusts up to 60 miles per hour possible there from the southeast. A winter storm watch is also posted for Haynes Highway from the Chilkat River Bridge and westward. Six to 12 inches possible there from Wednesday evening through Thursday morning there. So you look at Thursday, it looks like uh, winter weather will continue across some of the higher terrain. With Alaska statewide weather, this is meteorologist.